this so here, is... I think this is the take. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on, I can do another take here. Yeah, it's a nope. <laughs> hey, welcome to Behind the Scenes for Learning to Draw. Yeah, thank you for joining us. So this episode, pretty short, uh, one and a half minutes about um, drawing. Very simple task. We thought he could fail pretty badly at it. Somehow it's our most popular episode. Yeah, I guess drawing I, is just like... I can't fathom how it has that many views. 126 million. I think it's like, um, I think this was one of those weird ones where it's like the subject of drawing is really big on YouTube. The thumbnail was also somewhat intriguing. Yeah. But even then, it wasn't an intriguing thumbnail. It's, it's, it's just drawing is yeah. such a, a popular subject. It's a mystery to us why this one did so well, but... But we, we thank you very, very much for the views. Yeah. So... We start with like you throwing an apple. Yeah, we did like. How, like <laughs> we're like we're thinking, how can ticks. we like start this energetically, and kind of manically? Yeah, we, we so we actually had two apples for this. We had the stunt apple, which we bruised and maimed horribly, and then we had the beauty apple, which was just sitting there the whole time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we we're gonna do this. We did this like so Shit, many times. I want to hit that. Okay, I'm just gonna do another one. <laughs> we had him throw it like six or seven times because it would just bounce in different directions. So it's not yeah. a, not a perfect spheroid. It's like an apple. So um, once he finally threw it in a way that was like hilarious and silly enough. We just cut straight to him yeah. setting it down, cut straight to getting the page out and learn, and starting to draw. Yeah, so this was one of, um, I'm not sure how soon into our channel we started writing, but this one we have an actual like kind of pseudo script, I would say. Yeah. Where you can see that we've jotted down like a paragraph of kind of an idea, a brain dump, and then we broke it out into sequences. Yes. Yeah. Not even a script. Yeah, hardly a script. I mean, like we've gotten a lot more elaborate with our scripts nowadays, mm -hmm. and this is kind of just a half script, honestly, but it, it it's such a short episode that it doesn't need much and it pretty closely follows yeah what you see here i mean like you can see like each of these uh numbers coordinates with the scene and we basically recreated it almost perfectly with very little flair yeah so we did <laughs> so many takes of you trying to break the pencil in the right way and like yeah and, and how do we get it to look like you you're beginning to draw the semblance of an apple it's kind of a sphere right it's a curved line and then like immediately the pencil breaks and you have to for the... keep in mind like we, it's not like we rehearsed anything like we basically started filming with the idea in mind and that was the rehearsal so it was like mistake after mistake after mistake yeah and, and so what yeah. what happened here with the pencil because third time it completely breaks in half we had to pre-score it yeah i think we have footage of like, that's like me impossible. messing around with that what we have here so yeah this is uh multiple takes Trying to get good pencil breaks, trying to uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. pre-score it, and we—I uh, don't know—we sacrificed like at least five pencils for this episode. Yeah, numerous pencils died in the uh, line of battle for this episode. Okay, I don't think this is a good take either. I think it's like. Also, we didn't have our famous framing glasses yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he was just um, just had the camera on his head without any way of telling where he was looking, and I was constantly interrupting him to tell him yeah, yeah, look, look up, higher, down. look down, yeah. and that was how he did it. In so many of the early. Oh wait, episodes. I need to I need to pre-break half, completely halfway. Yeah. So yep. you know, uh, basically. This, so here, I think this is the take. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, oh it's my not. My God. <laughs> Hold on, I can do another take here. Yeah. So there's a nope. lot. Nope. <laughs> A lot of failures uh, a lot trying of to get failures. this stuff. Um, when you're working with the elements, like natural forces, like pencils and paper, you know, things can go wrong. I love it that it, I guess you, I guess you sharpened even the metal bit and the eraser at the end <laughs> yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. All you're this. left with is a, is a nub. You, you still even try to draw with that, but the pencil's gone. So what, what else are you gonna do now? This so, is like, this is like, okay, how do we? push the frustrations of drawing. Yeah, because like, okay, the next logical progression is from pencil to pen. Yeah. How do we make pen fail? Well, pen is like a permanent ink. Um, yeah, there's, there's no... You can't erase it. You, uh -huh. can, you know, like, how do you make this fail? So we thought, like, okay, so artists are kind of known for this cliche of putting their thumb in front of an object they're trying to draw to use as, like, a, a guide or a reference for, like, scale. Yeah. Or, like, I think I've seen this somewhere before. I'm not sure. I can't remember. Sure, sure, sure. But uh, he draws his thumb in front of it. Oh, Oops. Yeah. <laughs> And then, you know, uh, somehow he erases the exact <laughs> thumb shape. 
Like it's it's these kinds of things that I think um, I'm really happy with. Whenever we find a way to do it, it's just yeah. like simple, but it, it it's it's like the most pure form of a joke. And there's no transition between these two because we, no. we we talked about like could there be could we insert a part where like you see half the shavings on there or like shavings are flying right or something. But I think just cutting to it like fine, yeah. it worked. I think nowadays we probably wouldn't accept that. We, we probably, probably would have had like pencil shavings more. flying off or something or something appearing on the paper. But I I sat with this pen with this sharp uh with this eraser erasing sandpaper for like 10 minutes to yeah, get this yeah. giant and then of... and then i was like hey we could use that for the episode yeah no <laughs> what were you doing erasing sandpaper <laughs> but no that's that's what we ended up with um we didn't expect this episode to become so messy so quick and actually it adds so much to the episode yeah we're like not only are there Eraser shavings everywhere, but those pencil shavings, his hands are covered in pencil lead. Yeah, a lot of this we didn't obviously write. We didn't write detailed. Oh, oh, it's kind of a happy it. accident mm -hmm. that it just emerged, like being this messy. It, just... it, it gets very stressful very fast when messes start to accrue on a table like this because, like, it's hard to go backwards. And yeah. so, like, it's like, okay, we are we yeah. happy with everything to the point yeah. right now? Like, we knew that this was We're a one to take dump thing. Shavings everywhere. Are we happy? Like, as soon as he was like, okay, is that good? Is the yeah. framing right? And we're like, yeah, okay, go ahead. There's like these points of no return on a, a lot of our episodes where it's like we're about to just have an uncleanable mess let me see what this is we have another file here okay so yeah this is oh. kind of i drew this uh banana real quick uh well i don't know you were doing something i think i was actually eating a banana it might have been yeah. okay so grips the pencil tight and obviously i need to come in here with pencil shavings and swap it out because yeah, yeah, yeah. there needs to be a transition here it, it's it's <laughs> A lot of the stuff we do is like Careful we can't make papers. we can't mess up. Like had we spilled too much of this, it would have just taken a long time to clean up and reset. Yeah. Yeah, nice job with that. Good job, good job. Okay. Okay, so he resumes Let's here. Just give it a go, ready? Is it still recording? Okay, okay. So you can see how we kind of film it in like beats. Yeah. Where we're like, okay, is this good? Did we make, did we finish that section? Can yeah. We move on? I think in the past I was not as good at pausing. I would just go for it and then we'd be kind of screwed. Okay. Yeah, and so much is important with you holding your head still and mm -hmm. like, you know, matching between moments. We have to just constantly remember editing will come in and save the day, right? Yeah. Okay, and so obviously we need to swap out the page here for. Pushing something into the paper? Okay, sure. Exactly the apple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can see swapping I that. that. Was, I think we took the, the apple? photo of the apple and we 3D, we, yeah. we ske sketched it in. This is actually, this is a photo of that Photoshop. same apple. And then we applied a filter in Photoshop. A filter. I this think is before was, AI. Was it Photoshop? Yeah. This is before AI drawing tools were something a else. thing. That shows you all how okay, fast ready? AI is coming out. So. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Yep. Oh yeah, we also applied a little color grade to the footage. You can tell yeah, it's, yeah, it's kind of got more different. of a cinematic yeah. contrast. We usually do that. Yeah. A little bit of pseudo magic, I guess. A little did bit of reality bending. Sound effect. I did add. Funk. Yeah, I did add a little sound effect. Yeah, very subtle. It's like a. Funk. I think it's it's the subtlety that works for me. So that's how he achieves his drawing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After so much frustration, shove it into the paper, and then what you see. We got here? I guess that's how he does every single drawing. So, yes, the one that doesn't really make sense to me is the old couple. I know. A lot of comments are like, how did that... I'm, I'm, I'm guessing he ran at them really fast with a piece of paper and just, like, smashed into them or something. Anything is possible in this universe. Yeah, yeah. Well, but he, everything he was, else looks yeah. a little bit more smashed into mm -hmm. the page. Like, this bird clearly got smashed in. People were people were pretty sad about the cat. They're like, oh, the yeah, kitty. It, nothing ever really dies. It just gets frozen for yeah, eternity. Yeah, yeah. We had a comment from someone, I think, a long time ago where they were like, I'm calling the police, and then I made, like, a quick mock-up of a police officer in the yeah. same style where he's like pushed into the page so like even if the cops showed up to Mr. Butter's house he would just say oh a, an opportunity to oh, draw he would draw them yeah yeah he was in the drawing mood so oh gosh the blur is so bad back mm -hmm. on the back in the day with these cameras yeah um, we, we, we've gone through great lengths to minimize blur it still creeps yeah, in here with, and there with, with GoPro cameras nowadays it's way better and yep. we add lots more lighting so less a lot less blur but who cares it's, it still worked for this episode yeah, we have yeah. the desk which is nicely lit Super happy with this one. It's one yeah. of our favorites. It's one of the ones, one of the episodes that we've tried to emulate the most. Yeah, quite it's, often we say, "How do we do another learning to draw style?" Yeah, and a lot of our episodes have kind of emerged from trying to make another learning to draw. Like the the math one, I think, yeah. was a simple one at the desk. Um, even wood carving, I think, kind of yeah, emerged from us trying math. to do another like desk, small, simple episode. 
and those kind of balloon out of control sometimes. Like nowadays, we're just so free with I think our we're ideas. We're more confident with our execution, so we don't like. For all we know, had we written learning to draw today, yeah, it, it would, would have so much, much more elaborate effects and stuff. But maybe that would make it worse. I'm not sure. It, it yeah. could, it's just a different type of style. It's. Um, yeah. But, you know, this is such a successful episode for us that we're constantly looking at it as a benchmark. Mm -hmm, um, sure. And I'm um, super stoked that we got had have had so much success on it. It's been out for, wow, it's been five years. Oh, man. Just over five oh, years. Oh, time. Get out of here, time. <laughs> Get out of here. But, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, thank you again for checking this out. Yep, yeah, have a good one.